What is going on everybody and welcome back to another video. Uh, today's video is going to be a little discussion topic I wanted to go over. It's uh, very popular right now amongst the Fear of the Walking Dead because within Fear of the Walking Dead we have been seeing a lot of uh, just the theory videos and back and forth arguing and nobody can really decide who's telling the truth. And the thing I'm really talking about is, is Alicia actually dead? And uh, I just wanted to cover a couple different things that kind of kind of point in the direction that uh, Troy is lying and Alicia, he either knows that she's alive or he is not for sure. And uh, it's just uh, a couple of things I want to t touch base on. So when Troy was first reintroduced back into this world, he went out of his way immediately to tell Madison that I killed Alicia. Here's her prosthetic arm made from her own bone. And... Everyone on Madison's side just immediately had no doubt about it. They did not question it. They just it accepted it. And every episode, well, the two episodes that we've gotten, they just keep going saying, Troy said she's dead, so it must be true. And just, it seems kind of dumb that they would just go on his word alone. And with this most previous episode, we got kind of more um, speculation, I guess, and more confirming all at the same time too that Troy has to be lying or he doesn't know for sure and he's doing this one thing to kind of play mind games with Madison and that is removing the arms from random walkers sending them out into the wild hoping that she finds them and she has come across a couple and just completely just for lack of a better word mind fucking her and trying to just mess with her to the point where she just absolutely believes him. Everyone on her side has no doubt about it that Alicia is dead. But as it goes with this particular show, no one's gone until they're gone. That's like one of the big famous taglines of the show. It just fed right into the theory that Madison was alive the whole time because we did not actually see her die. And lo and behold, she is alive. You know, she has damage from being in the stadium fire and everything, but... I think the same is going to be said about Alicia. I don't think she's dead. And just with the fact that they keep bringing her up, again, it's only been two episodes, but they keep bringing her up both episodes with the initial shock and awe, I guess, that Troy says, oh, I killed her, here's her arm. And in this most previous episode, the whole idea of finding her walker corpse and putting her to rest. And it's like they keep, they keep uh, casting doubt in a sense, the writers do, saying Madison's 100% sure that she's dead. But then we have Troy doing his thing with the walkers and just playing these games and maybe she's not dead. And it just keeps going back and forth, back and forth, like they are setting us up. Could they be setting us up to fail? Absolutely. They could just be like, well, we, we're just playing games with this. She's really dead. Even though you didn't see it, she died off screen. And I think that would be a big injustice to this particular character because she is one of the original survivors from this show. It would be cheating the fans, cheating the storyline, and just be flat out lame if they did this. And so with them going back and forth, raising the question, is she dead? She could be alive. And just going back and forth, playing these games. And I think that they're going to continue to do this until the final episode where she's randomly going to pop up Maybe Troy has her prisoner. Maybe he thought he killed her and took her arm. Maybe she got away or he just doesn't know for sure. I think there's still a lot of questions to be answered, a lot of uncertainties surrounding this particular part of the story, and I think they could still take it either way. I, for one, I hope Alicia Dunham Carey comes back and re-portrays the role of Alicia, giving her a final closeout. Her and Madison could have that happy ending. They go off into the sunset. Maybe we'll see them in the spinoff, but I feel like with them kind of pulling the Hail Mary, bringing Madison back, it was only to give her character that closeout that she deserved. And I really think that's the only direction that they can really take it and it not completely piss off the fan base because they have to see that along the way they have lost fans repeatedly with particular storylines, characters showing up or characters leaving and just the all-around bad writing that they've had season after season but I think this would be a way to kind of justify all that bad writing and give these characters the goodbye that they deserve because we saw Morgan go off his exit was open-ended I really hope we see Lenny James again come back and do his thing be reunited with Rick but that's 
a wait and see kind of thing. Maybe we could see it in the recently announced crossover spinoff series that we're supposed to get where it's supposed to bring uh, Daryl, Dead City, and now the upcoming um, Rick and Michonne spinoff to bring all those shows, cross them all over, do you know? Have let them have their individual stories to close them out, and then bring them all together to give the big reunion that we all want to see. But uh, that's neither here nor there. And I guess if we're going to talk about open ended, obviously Alicia was open ended along with Morgan. We don't know the true fate of what happened to her. And now we got this little girl that was introduced in the last episode. We haven't seen her on screen yet, but we have seen her within the teasers and everything. That this is Troy's daughter, and somewhere along the way. The woman that I guess dug him out of this rubble from the dam explosion became the mother of this child, or she actually birthed this child, and this is his blood child. Uh, somehow along the way, Madison is responsible for her death too. So uh, there's just a couple of different things that just are really, I guess, popping because the also the big theory out there too, or the possibility, I don't think it's true, but that uh, Alicia is Troy's baby mama and <laughs> just i think that's kind of ridiculous but who knows they've done sillier things within this show uh just i really think that they're playing games with us and i think that they're going to set us up for a big reveal that alicia is alive in some form or another where she whether she's a prisoner whether they come across her out in the wild again or what could possibly come of that particular situation but anyways that is the quick little video I wanted to do about this particular topic. I know it's a popular topic out there right now because it's it's a big drawing point for this final season. Could we see her again? We don't know. I hope we do. But uh, I think that will do it, guys. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Please leave your comments. And as always, if you feel so inclined, please subscribe to the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So until next time, guys, I will see you later. Bye.